Hi, I'm Danielle Valiente, hair and beauty expert, and I'm going to share with you how to curl long hair with sponge rollers using products, tools, and technique. Let's get started. So begin by using a soft sculpting spray gel to create a little bit of saturation in the hair. Not too much, just a little bit. Now you can use these rollers from wet to dry. You could saturate a little bit with a spray gel or you can do it on dry hair. The strength of the curl is going to be stronger the more wet the hair is. So using a spray gel just to create a little bit of moisture, we're going to section the side first starting in the bottom. And then we're going to alternate between two different sizes of sponge rollers. We're going to start with the bigger sponge roller in the bottom. And at about halfway, place the roller into the hair horizontally. Wrap the ends around and tuck them up underneath as you roll the sponge roller to the scalp. Then you'll take the roller and twist, crossing over each end, and that'll just hold that roller right in place. And we're going to move up to the next section. Now again, if the hair is a little bit more wet, you're going to get a stronger hold to the curl. If you mist it down or apply it onto dry hair like we're doing here, you're going to get less strength in the curl. You can use a heating tool like a blow dryer or a hood dryer to really help the curl So wrapping halfway, tucking those ends up and under, and rolling down, and then twisting the roller. And our final section on top will be with a large wrap and roll the sponge roller down. and then twist, holding it into place. And when you twist it, it just stays right in place like such. So when you're finished, you'll have a whole head of these sponge rollers where you can take your hair dryer to it to really help set the curl, or you can even let it dry natural. And that is how to curl long hair with sponge rollers.